Hey everybody, it's Party Elite. Welcome you back to our two-point campus let's play, where we return to Spiff and Moore for one last time. That's right, folks. If all goes well today, we should be acquiring that third star relatively quickly. Now, something might go sideways. There might be some unexpected events or situations that slow us down, perhaps, but I would be shocked if we don't get that third star today. And after that's been had, we're going to go ahead and dive on in to Fluffborough, the next campus in our journey through Two Point County. Now, we'll see where exactly the session is when we've acquired that third star. If we're, you know, 30, 40 minutes into the session, then maybe that's not the best time to start a new campus. But if it literally only takes us like 10 or 20 minutes to get this third star at Spiffinmore, maybe we do push into Fluffborough. I don't know. We'll play it by ear. But of course, in anticipation of us going to a primarily sort of sports school let's start thinking about some of those sports uh, metaphors and, uh, and and puns and and analogies we can make as far as the names for parties are concerned as far as names for the various kinds of movies are concerned so feel free to start dropping those in the comments already because we know where we're headed next so uh, we might as well prepare ourselves for it so there's no time spent uh, without having appropriately named parties and movie nights right anyway with that intro out of the way and with that prep work out of the way let's go ahead and dive on in just spiffin more all right folks like i said there isn't that much left to do just a bit of staff happiness and uh, getting that campus level to level 22 it, uh, it really shouldn't be that difficult. This academic year is going to finish, but heading into the next academic year, I don't think we'll have to do too much adjustment. We can spend some time building uh, some of the buildings out a bit more and adding a couple more rooms, and that way we'll get to campus level 22 a bit more fluidly. Again, I never want to cheese the systems if I can avoid it. I never want to do something that feels like, oh, let's just, like, for example, right now, I could easily hire, like, I don't know, 10 to 20 janitors and hit that campus level 22. But to me, that kind of feels like if I was playing purely to just like get this level over with so we could move on, all right, I would do that. And by the way, just to be clear, zero judgment on people who do that. I totally understand it 100% completely fair approach. But for me personally, it kind of breaks my, my own personal approach to how I play video games where I try to make things as believable or real or just I don't know like acceptable as as possible and and in my eyes hiring 20 janitors at the end of an academic year just to reach an arbitrary campus level seems a little weird like no campus in the real world would do that um obviously no campus in the real world teaches wizardry and witchcraft either but like that's part of the game whereas like hiring 20 janitors is kind of like hopefully you understand what I'm getting at it, it's obviously we're in a fantastical world here right as <laughs> as fire rains down from the skies but there's still aspects of the game that are you know trying to be realistic and trying to be a simulation that's kind of the the point with these games is like funny circumstances but very real things that you're considering and balancing and all that good stuff so uh, I am trying to be cognizant of of that and I don't want to get to campus level 22 uh by uh uh I, I don't know the best way to word it by like just like shoving stuff in there and making it happen. So we'll do some expansion because like inter-academic year um, renovations and stuff are very believable, of course. I don't think we need another plot. I don't think we have to grow our, uh, our like subject offerings or anything like that. We might just add a couple more dorms, for example, on either side of, uh, uh, of this building over here or perhaps for, for both of these buildings, maybe we'll add some more dorms on, on, on either wing. Uh, or maybe we'll, uh, what else could we do? We could, we could also consider adding some more like, uh, like student service type rooms. Like instead of, uh, extending dorms over here, we could instead get, uh, like, uh, another medical center, another, um, uh, what's called like pastoral care room down over here, perhaps maybe another washroom right at the end. So there's still stuff we can do for sure. There's still stuff we can do uh, r rather easily as well uh, to get us to campus level 22. That's still, again, believable as something a, a campus might actually do. Buddy over here, Montgomery hurt, seems quite hurt thinking about dropping out. Hopefully after this class is done, they'll be able to uh, replenish their energy. That seems to be the big bummer. Otherwise they've got Things pretty good, I would say. Like, overall, they seem to be all right. A little hungry, um, a little dirty, uh, very tired. I, I I understand that feeling, of course. I understand that feeling. So hopefully, they'll get a chance to rest, get their uh, their, their medical issues sorted out over here, their pumpkin head removed, and, uh, and then they'll be uh, feeling peachy as opposed to 
like a pumpkin, I suppose. Anyway, let's go ahead and take a look at uh, our staff training as well. Because remember, to get happiness up, our current approach is to improve us. Are you... It's every time. Every time. Every time. They'd like, even if it's just out of the corner of, uh, of like, the wall, and I catch a glimpse of, uh, <laughs> of that contrast, let's call it. Hard to, hard to ignore. Um, but yes, so uh, just as a reminder, I want to try and get staff happiness up to 65% primarily through the use of training. I quite like how that feels and uh, and how that works. Uh, and then, of course, we have improved the staff room a fair bit. We have added the second staff room as well, just as a reminder. And we've adjusted how uh, staff actually take breaks, right? If we go to not there, but here, uh, we, we've actually, I, I guess increased what the it's kind of weird increased the threshold for when staff take breaks we we've changed how quickly staff decide to take breaks when their needs are not being met right so hopefully they're taking breaks a bit more often especially when it's the um like when it's the uh, like the janitors and the, uh, the the assistants when well, they're kind of a bit more fluid in terms of when they have to work versus not whereas teachers obviously have a very strict schedule so hopefully at least a big part of our staff is able to take more time off and take those breaks when they need them to or, or when they need to sorry uh, rather than waiting until the threshold gets really low and then they're really miserable and then they, they take a short break it doesn't really fulfill their needs and they're back out working again and they're, they're, they're in this endless cycle of unfulfilled needs hopefully this helps a little bit uh, in, in, in keeping those needs fulfilled and I do think we're doing an all right job I mean these teachers and, and stuff are feeling a lot happier than they ever have I think uh, and as we can see, of course, our, our, our average staff happiness is at 60% right now. Uh, so I, I feel pretty good about how this is working out. But for the time being, let's go ahead and take a look at these awards from this past academic year and just see uh, how things turned out. I think we did quite well this year. I hope we won a handful of awards. Our previous year, we won quite a few awards. Uh, I don't think we can top that, but maybe we can at least match it. That would make me happy if we at least match the previous year where we won... Well, quite a few. I'll, 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 I'll think about which ones we might have missed this year or which ones we uh, we didn't miss, I guess, as we uh, hit next. Uh, so, of course, 100% pass rate. We had one person who was thinking about dropping out, but I think once they got their pumpkin head sorted, I think they decided to stay. Uh, but uh, the um, I don't think I'll ever forget that one person who dropped out. I, I think I will forever think about uh, our, our dropout at Spiff and More. Hopefully we don't have more join in, you know, as our... Uh, as our campuses spread across the county, but uh, but that will definitely stand out to me. 84% average exam results. Honestly, I feel so pleased with uh, with how this campus has done, um, com considering how it began, right? So done there, we've got ourselves the queen of clubs. Okay, good stuff. We have ourselves teacher of the year. Okay, we've got uh, campus of the year. Okay, good stuff, good stuff. And that's it, ah, so we did not beat uh, or even match, to be fair, last year's efforts, uh, which included the, uh, the king of uh, king of hearts, right? I'm pretty sure we got King of Hearts last year. Um, I don't recall if we got Academic Excellence. Or anything else. No, I thought I thought we had... I thought we did have Academic Excellence. Yeah, I think last year we had Academic Excellence and also the King of... Uh, King of... Uh, King of... King of... King of Clubs, sorry. King of... King of... King of Hearts. I keep thinking in my head, Queen of... Queen of Hearts, King of Clubs. But no, it's the other way around. Right, right. So we did not get the one about helping student relationships, and we did not get the one about uh, having the best grades, which is unfortunate. I thought we were doing quite well. We have the A over here, 84%. That's not enough. That might actually be some of the highest uh, average academic results we've ever seen. So that's that's a bit of a shock, I'm not going to lie. Uh, either way, it's fine. It's fine. Not the end of the world. Uh, we've got plenty of money to work with, so I'm not too concerned about that. We have the Dark Arts Open Day. Go ahead and come on through. Student Lounge Party Wanted by three people. we got 100 days to do that, so early on uh, next year we might do that. But uh, for the time being, I'm going to let time move forward. We're at 59% average staff happiness, so it's actually dropped from 60. But I think when we have summer breaks, staff will take care of themselves just like students do. We'll see student happiness and staff happiness go up. And uh, and so I'm not going to pause, and instead I'm going to make some uh, renovations as, as as time is moving forward, right? So uh, I, I feel like... I mean, I like the idea of having more dorms. I just don't know if they'll fit over here. Let's go ahead and sell this. And let's go ahead and sell this as well. Right, because then we can expand the building like so. 
Uh, we'll be quick about this. By the way, I've seen quite a few uh, comments with regards to uh, bringing time lapses and stuff back. Uh, it, it's it's great feedback for me. It's good for me to know that uh, there's an interest in that approach and, and, and an adjustment to uh, how I've been doing things lately. So uh, thank you very much for sharing. Uh, if we do this, hold on, but before I get into this, uh, so I, I do want to thank you very much for, for sharing that feedback because again, like I say always, it really helps me make just decisions uh, as to how I uh, approach things on the channel. So uh, I will be keeping that in mind as I uh, go forward with um with two point campus uh i think a lot of the time i when i when i don't do a time lapse for uh for uh laying out a room or something it's because there are some thoughts i want to express about how i'm approaching it uh and i i, I think they'll take a lot longer to express than they actually end up taking to express and then i kind of go like mm, i didn't really film that in a way that's suitable for a time lapse but don't worry i i uh all that to say this uh, i'm definitely keeping that in mind moving forward and i will be adjusting my uh, approach accordingly as well uh but uh, bear with me if it takes a bit of time for me to uh to to make those adjustments i suppose right but uh, i want to make sure over here like for example here i want to kind of like talk this through because it might seem strange without an explanation and yet moving at time lapse speed it's not enough time i think to give a, an explanation as to what i decided to do uh, but yeah i, I think what i want to do is i leave a little bit of a gap over here so that um, these windows can still be windows and these bedrooms don't lose any prestige because of course we're making a lot of money from uh from what's the word i'm looking for uh rent right um so that's all good a little unfortunate that these windows will become useless, but that's okay. We could probably shift some stuff over and, uh, and keep two windows, but just move some of these things around. Cool. So we have this kind of extend this way, and then we'll put like dorms over here, I suppose. Invasion's been taken care of. Okay, good stuff. Let's go ahead and accept that, right? But it's not the building that improves our uh, campus level. It's the actual rooms within. So let's go ahead and uh, and wait for that to get built up. Oh, it's okay. That, that 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 happened faster than I expected. Just gonna nudge these guys over to uh, here. Oh, come on now. Hmm. Just let me like just let me just let me do it. You know. Oh, come on. It won't fit. Really? Okay. Uh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Pull you over to here, perhaps, or even get rid of you. How much of a difference do you actually make? Not much. Okay, so let's get rid of you. And let's go ahead and get you... Well, he's being looked at right now. Get the radiator... Out of here, actually. And why don't we get that uh, that low radiator? This one. Yeah, there we go. Because it does the same, like, area, right? So let's pop you down over there. That should be okay. And let's get the, uh, the windows. And, you know, with the windows in place, the... Um, the... Uh, extra like pastoral care thing might have made a difference oh you know what? actually no we're at four already so perfect we'll keep it at that good stuff good stuff is the is this not reaching you oh it seems warm enough there's it's just that one corner that's not very warm but like come on you got to come into this room and hang out of that one corner come on now come on now work with me here <laughs> work with me here all right this is good um why don't we go ahead and clone buddy here Pop you down there because we've needed more of these i think for a while now i've been trying to keep them spread out like we have two of them here we've got one over here we just don't have room for another one down over here unless they do like a major reorganization right so i'm gonna i'm gonna keep this up over here do we really need another lecture theater is that like for real or is that just uh messing with me because if we need another lecture theater i could try and fit another one in over here i don't know if it'll fit four by four no it won't fit it will not fit unless i expand this a bit further back as well why do we need a fourth lecture theater? We're taking 18, 18, 13. How, when do these numbers change? It should be 16. 16. There we go. And... Uh, we don't need money that much anymore, so 16? Yeah, cool. 16, 16, 16. 93 students, good tuition fees. We'll confirm that for now. We haven't spent any course points, so we can always undo any of the changes we made right over there. But that'll get rid of the need for the, uh, the lecture theater. I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense. All right, can I fit these dorms in here? If I clone you, can I pop you down over here? You will fit, but obviously only one can fit. We can get a corner dorm, I suppose. If we want to shrink these any further, the door would have to be shifted. Uh, we'd have to make some adjustments. Something like this. What happens in that corner? We can make like a bit of a, a like a lounge type space. Sure. Let's put you down over here. Go ahead and move the bin 
Well, let's get rid of the bin and the iHeart TP so we can get the door. Where is the door? Up over here. Really, you'll fit. There we go. Perfect. And now we need the uh, the bin and the iHeart TP back. Bin in this corner over here, I think. Yep. Yeah. And TP. Oh, that's made up. Where, where would it be? What would I search? What is it called? Two point banner. Oh, okay, banner. I was gonna say, I was like, it's not a poster. And I know it's not a poster. Pop you up there, good stuff. And how is this invalid? Good, room not reachable. Oh, it's because of the radiator. Oh, well, uh, God, <laughs> fine, fine game, fine. There you go, cool. Uh, two invalid items are what? The windows, I assume? We're okay, we're okay. Let's go ahead and actually shift this window over. This is where things get funny, because like, do you really want to be able to look from <laughs> one room into the other? Not the nicest feeling. And what do I want to do here as well? Do I want to put a hedge down there, I suppose? Like a snowy, snowy hedge. Yeah, that's okay, I think. It's fussing over it maybe a little too much previously. Why can't I do this? Oh, because of the tree? Probably, presumably. Put the tree down over here. Bring this tree down to match it. As best as I can without fussing over it too much. Let's get you over to here. Oh, come on. Come on, do I really need to move you more? Get rid of you for now. Plan around the hedges, right? Because the hedges are like dictated by the shape of the building. So there we go. All right, now that tree. I would like to have it back. If I can't have it back, it's not the end of the world. I would like to have it back. Oh, it's just by a little bit. All right, there, there are other trees we can put down as well. Um, there are many other trees. There, there are thinner, taller ones. Oh, let's get a seasonal pine tree. This is the kind of place where you'd have a pine tree, right? Can you fit? You will fit. Yeah, okay, cool. Pop you down there and pop you down there. Um, yeah, sure. Leave, leave it at the entrance. That'll be fine. I'm actually wondering about this uh, street light. As referenced in pop music? Okay, I legitimately don't get it. <laughs> I actually don't get it. But I will, I will, I will get some. We got, we got plenty of kudosh. We don't have to, we don't have to be too conservative. Let's go and pop you down there. Some of you will actually light up though. Otherwise, it's kind of silly. I'm buying them so they'd add a nice bit of like, I guess, atmosphere to our to our campus at night. But it doesn't look like they light up. Are you for real? Like a switch? Gameplay effects? None. I, I wasn't expecting any gameplay effects, but I was hoping to see, uh, you know, just like a subtle soft glow or something. What do we have here? Open day report? Okay, good stuff. Invasion report? Good stuff. Student lounge party still wanted? Yes, of course. I was really hoping we would see this get up to 63 or something, but I think we have to start the academic year and just do training. I think training is what will get us there, maybe. 62%. Staff are hopefully taking care of themselves. Lots of people using the break room right now. This guy wants training. All right, I want to go ahead and give you some training then. Um, schedule you right off the bat for, uh, what, extra private tuition, perhaps? Extra level of dark arts, maybe. Let's go for that. Start training dark arts, um, and, and, and yeah, I guess it'll be it'll be training that uh, that sends us over the, uh, the 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 tipping point. As I'd kind of expect, it's campus level twenty two. We're still not there. We're not not that close. But a lot of new students will be joining in next uh, next semester who will be leveling up and all that stuff. So that should help a tremendous amount. Still want to play it a little safe here. Let's go ahead and build. Um, do it like this. Build you down to here. Right, we've got the hedge in there so that one can stay in there. We don't have to sell it this time. Uh, good stuff. Yes. Yes. Go ahead and uh, get ourselves the snowy hedge. Standing down this way and then over. Oh, come on now. There we go. And then we'll go ahead and get this... Uh, Storm cloned. Mouse is not cooperating there for a second. Uh, pop you down over here like so. Yeah, sure. Uh, and then let's go ahead and get the door moving. I don't know why my mouse is just like, it's got a mind of its own there. I uh, get rid of this uh, Pasho poster. Keep the door there. Get this moved up here, I suppose. Get the door over. Oh, come on. Surely we'll fit. There we go. Beautiful. Where is my Pasho poster? There it is. You set up over. Hmm. Nice corner over here, maybe. Let's go with uh, let's go with this corner over here. 
behind the plant. Completely invisible. Sure, let's put it up over here. A bit more, a bit more logical, I think. Fix invalid items, room not reachable. Oh, it's because I didn't do the, uh... Oh. Game, don't do this to me. Don't make me have to cancel this just to... This is... I really don't like this. <laughs> like, let me make adjustments elsewhere. If you're not gonna let me uh, put the other uh, thing down. Alright, let's... I guess we do have to sell this then. Alright, 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 alright. You're gone? Okay, cool. You're gone. Go ahead and build. Uh, like so. The window can be maintained. This is a little different than the other side, but that's okay. That's all we really need. That's all we really need. Alright, now we can go ahead... Clone you, flip you around, so the windows are pointing inside intentionally, even though we totally have the option to not do that. Uh, go ahead and put you up over there. Go ahead and put you up over there. Now let's get that door back over here. Perfect. Done. Almost. We're almost there. I think a couple students getting their uh, levels up and stuff will do the trick. We can go ahead and uh, clone one of these spaces. Where Where is the chill space? This thing. I wish you could clone multiple things at a time. Like, without them needing to be in a room, you know? But make a nice chill space over here. Right next to the uh, the dorms and, 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 and where the um, pastoral care and medical care and stuff is. I think that makes sense. Uh, can I? Are you? You're no, nowhere near, like, properly aligned. Go and do, like, this kind of a thing. Sure, that's better, I think, at least. That's better. Let's go ahead and clone some of these guys. Go ahead and put one down over there and one down over here. Nice and easy. Why don't we go ahead and do a similar thing over here. We'll go ahead and get... Um, what do we want? We want some food and stuff, perhaps. Some snacks. Let's go ahead and copy you. Pop you down over here. Let's go ahead and get this guy and pop you down on the flip side over here. And why don't we get a water cooler as well so people can actually drink something that's not soda. Uh, that might be a good idea every once in a while, you know, just to have something that's not terrible for you. Pop that over there, and let's get a... Oh, let that go down. Come on. Cool, and let's get a bin down as well. Because God knows we're going to litter this space. Cool, cool, cool. And let's go ahead and get the uh, the Pearl of Wisdom as well. Quite like it as a central uh, piece, as a centerpiece, if you will. Yeah, cool. Little Pearls of Wisdom everywhere. So that's quite nice. And then down over here, I, I wish I wish there were other colors of this shape of couch. Because I quite like the shape of this couch, but I wish I could like get it in gold and stuff as well. And I don't think... Yeah, like these are all different shapes, right? Like there's two of this shape, but just one of this. And this one's the, the fancier looking... Anyway, it's fine. It's not the end of the world or anything. I was just like, would have been nice, would have been nice. Pop you down like so, and pop you down like... Come on now. All right, fine, let's do that. Let's do that. I think that works well enough. Not aligned to the tiles at all, even remotely. Not the end of the, again, not the, end of the world, but every once in a while, it's nice to, to get things to line up. Get you cloned. And I'm, I'm not uh, like I'm, I'm, I'm not just doing this to, to kill time here. I want to try and get that staff happiness higher, but I don't think it's actually uh, having the intended effect, unfortunately. I think we're just uh, we're seeing it fluctuate in those in those 60s, low 60s. So I think we'll need to. Um, yeah, dedicate uh, to, to, to training. Oh, come on. It's like, it's it's highlighting green, but then it's not actually letting me put it down. All right, that's all well and good. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and clone you. Pop you down over here. Let's go ahead and clone Buddy as well. Pop you down over here. So that's Cheesy Gubbins, and I think that's the uh, the, the palpitation, right? But I'm going to pick you up, put you there. And let's actually put a copy over here as well. And you need a water cooler here as well. Just to make sure there are options. Pop you down over here. Great. Socializing space. Cool. Let's go ahead and start the academic year, I think. We've got uh, as much as we can do done. Um, we'll get to campus level 22 and we'll get that staff happiness high as we uh, train some staff. All right. Let's go ahead and hit uh, continue. Or not continue, but start next year. Nothing else is needed. Yeah, we're good. Let's go ahead and begin. Hopefully, staff will immediately go into train. I, again, I think the, the big thing right now is to make sure we are always training some staff or the other. And if at the end of training staff, so rather, no, if we hit campus level 22 before we're done training staff, we will uh, we will give some raises because I think we can afford it now. Yeah, we can afford some raises. Um, and if we get uh, if we get staff happiness before we get campus level, then we might hire some more staff. Uh, just to um, uh, just to to, to 
to, to add a couple more. I think we I think we'd be fine adding like one more janitor, uh, one more assistant. I think there there have been a couple times here and there where we've needed an assistant, an assistant's been missing, and we'll get ourselves uh, maybe another teacher as well. Though I do think we're okay on that front. Lots of assignments being completed right now, so that's good to see. We'll be making some good XP bonus money in August. Uh, lots of A's as well. That's good to see too. Student happiness is at 64%. I guess a lot of new students coming in right now aren't uh, the most pleased, but we have some training going on right now. Hopefully this will help. I mean, look at that. All their needs are met. It's a nice environment. Not the most prestigious, so I suppose I could uh, make some adjustments over here. We got a rug down. We get some, we got paintings down. Actually, this is... I mean, we, we've already come back here and, and, and made this space up. They sat down for all of 30 seconds and immediately had to leave because of... Um, because of... Uh, What's it called? Um, sorry, I got distracted by the fact you can get tea and biscuits in, 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 in the training room. Which makes sense, right? It's a training room. Um, they, they got pulled away for their, their courses right away. Just trying to make this place hit that next level of prestige. Not sure what else to get here. Windows, where would they look? Windows wouldn't look anywhere in particular. Staff room. Staff watching staff get training. Expanding their aspirations. Go ahead and do that. Uh, but yes, let's go ahead and then find some janitors and stuff who can maybe get some training instead. Once training, let's go ahead and train you then. Uh, let's get uh, you... Sure, let's let's add a level of comic timing. Where'd you go? Uh, train, comic timing, go. Good stuff. Make your way over right now. Or who else is queued up right now? I also really don't need these guys helping with club recruitment. Like, it's just not a necessity. Students do it on their own, so we don't need that. So, uh, stop it. <laughs> Alright. Good stuff. Get to work, get to work. 59%. That's the thing. As soon as uh, the, 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 the year starts, staff are just less happy because they're... working, you know. <laughs> Who wants to do that? Who wants to do that? Maybe let's speed time up a little bit. Just keep an eye on staff training because I do want to. I do want to try and complete Spiff and more today. I don't want it to. Don't want it to be in that weird state where we're like, just perpetually stuck here. And I've seen quite a few of you mention in the comments that it took forever to actually get Spiff and more done because just to reach that level of efficiency and and just to reach these numbers was a bit of a bit of a hassle. And if it proves to be a chore, if it starts to become a chore, then you know what? I will game the system and get us that third star. But I, that's not the. I don't want that to be the first thing I do. You know what I mean? I want to give it a shot. I want to give it its fair shake. Uh, but if it's not being fair back, then we'll uh, we'll we'll certainly take a, a different approach. But let's take a look over here. Buddy is almost done. This should help their staff their their happiness a fair bit. Like it's it's not insignificant. From fifty eight to seventy something you know well like <laughs> that is not insignificant probably improves our baselines quite a bit uh who else can we train over here you're feeling okay what about you you might have a class soon look at your schedule you don't okay so why don't we go ahead and give you some training uh train you and give you you've got general knowledge let's let's add another step to that 34 days it'll take sure go for it I'm almost wondering if I want another staff, like, training room, actually. Just to speed up the rate at which we can train staff. Like, how are you doing? I could select you. I could select you. Kinda happy, I guess. Trying to figure out which ones I should- who I should prioritize. The ones who are, uh, low on happiness or the ones who are high on happiness. You. Let's get you training. Once training, let's go ahead and get you training in... Research. 30 days is all it'll take, so sure, let's queue you up. Yeah. Because, like, ultimately, the higher the number, the better, but I don't know if there's diminishing returns with, uh, with training, right? Like, if you've already had some training and then you get some more training, will it increase your happiness by the same amount, or is it by, by less, by, by a smaller number? Money's looking great, by the way. Money's looking fantastic. We did, of course, fire, what was it, two uh, two of our staff to help us reach uh, higher higher profit margins. I think it's worked out for us quite nicely, so that's all good. Please tell me you're going to finish your... Are you for real? You didn't finish your training? Cause it's because their needs are too low. Okay. 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 <laughs> 
unfortunate. Uh, Matilda Fox, let's go ahead and get you maybe moving faster. Aerodynamics, let's go. Mainly because you're right there. Get in there, let's go. Ah, buddy, buddy beat you to it. That's okay, that's okay. As long as training is happening. As long as training is happening. Winter break coming through now as well. I'm gonna let students do their uh, learning rounds and stuff. No, no parties this uh, this year. There's a bit of a light show though, that's for sure. Funny how two times speed goes so much faster. <laughs> oh, I still wish there was a three times speed. How are we looking here? Almost at level 22. Close, very close. How you doing, buddy? 62% happiness. Another month done. Getting there, getting there. Average is 60 while the school year is active, which is not bad. It's not bad. Oh, as I say that, of course, it dips down to 59%. Let's go. God, it does take time, doesn't it? Maybe I do need more training facilities. You're going to get happier, right? Yeah, okay. Good, good, good. I do wonder about the diminishing returns. Looks okay, though. Looks okay. Can I get you some training? Maybe I should get some people who have no training and get them some training. Oscar Thumper. Oh, that comic timing. Let's go. Come on, get in there. There we go. No, don't take a break. The downside of having their thresholds be uh, be too low. Somebody else coming in here then? You want training? Okay, get training then. <laughs> just anybody. Just anybody. Let's begin. Cool. Perfect. It'll still only take 30 days if, uh, if I saw the number right. So we should be okay. Getting, getting far along. Again, I, I don't mind giving raises if we don't reach uh, campus level 22. We're getting there. You can see it's slowly creeping higher and higher. Every time a student levels up, right? So... Next semester, when uh, a bunch of the year ones spend some time in, uh, in in their classes, we should be okay. It is really slow, though, isn't it? Again, I guess diminishing returns for everything as you as you get further along. I don't think we'll need another plot. I think all we'll need maybe is uh, is a bit more, uh, maybe another room or something, maybe some more dorms over here or something like that. I don't think we'll need another plot, though. Just wonder if I should. Uh, Get that going right away, or if, if we are en route to get that campus level 22. This guy's almost done. Another invasion has been taken care of. Excellent. A and again, it might be between years that we actually see that 65% just because staff are so busy right now, but... As long as we see it... As long as we see it today. <laughs> that's that's kind of my primary, my primary hope here. Looking okay. Wonder who I sent to, to training next. Buddy's almost done. Lots of people are heading to classes, so it must be like an assistant or, or something that, that we can train. You, do you want training? You look you're, like you're okay. Feeling like career development helps with happiness quite a bit. Wow. Okay, that's huge, actually. Plus 20%. Flat number. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Um, Does it not stay? Career development? At plus 20%? Surely it gives a, a permanent boost, but also a temporary boost, I assume. Uh, who do we have? Who do we have? Who do we have? In the area, especially. Because I want them to move in quickly, right? Buddy just got done. A bit of training. Um, buddy here doesn't need training. Career development. They already have that perk. Why don't we get you in there? Well, because you've already had a fair bit of training. That's why. What about you? You want training. You haven't had any training. So, sure. Let's go ahead and train you in... Uh, aerodynamics. He's, he's got lollygagger, so they should help counteract that a little bit. Up you go. Straight to training. No, not water plant. Train staff in aerodynamics. Thank you. Let's go. Perfect. I just gotta do that. I gotta scoop them up and drop them in. Because otherwise they're wasting time walking around. Not doing anything. Personable snowman. That's, that's pretty good. As opposed to abominable. That's pretty good. Someone's planning on dropping out. Hopefully they'll be taken care of. Were they stuck? They might have been stuck.
What's going on over here? What's happening over here? This 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 student looks stuck. Okay, cool. Stop that. Now they can go ahead and, and eat or do whatever they actually want to do. Come on. Come on. Okay, let's send you to medical care. See if see if you can get a little bit further along. Looks like some training's been completed, so that's good. Um, campus level's looking good as well. We've got ourselves the mayoral visit done. Invasion report done. A chemical friendship wanted. That'll have to wait. Dark art open day. Go ahead and accept that. Horror film wanted. Focusing on our staff this year. <laughs> you've joined uh, You've joined the, uh, the school at the wrong year. You've been scheduled for training. Are you about to dive in now? Is that why you're here? No. Oh, you're gone. Okay, great. On a break. Tired. Fair enough. Buddy's left. Okay, good. You, you want training? You want training. Okay, let's go ahead and... Nope, that's not how we're going to do it. We're going to go ahead and pick you right up and put you right down. No. Worked last time. No. <laughs> I said it worked last time. Oh, is it because Buddy's still in here, technically? All right. There we go. Campus maintenance. <laughs> no, no, I want you to train. I want you to train your aerodynamics up one more step. That's what I want you to do. There we go, buddy. That's what we're talking about. I knew he'd get there eventually. Somebody else can do the maintenance. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. 20 staff members are ready for training. Staff happiness is kind of low, but again, I think that's just because, you know, it's a school year. They're not getting their breaks in. I'm really pleased with how the, the break rooms and stuff are actually operating now. Like we've we've made quite a bit of a difference with the, like the the tea and and, and snacks and stuff. The prestige is quite good as well. Like I'm pleased with how all that's working. But of course we still have uh, some gaps to fill because otherwise happiness wouldn't be so low. He's using the washroom, but his happiness is dropping because his what hyg hygiene is dropping. <laughs> is that why? Kind of wild. <laughs> it's like <laughs> I don't know how. Suitably, that's balanced. No, mood, mood is dropped for something else, for for sure. Maybe because the prestige of the room they're in, or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Training here is done. Buddy's lined up, I think, for it. You are getting happier. Yes. Excellent. Go, go, go. Cycle in. Come on now. You're right there. Yeah. Beautiful. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Campus level 22 has been reached. Now it's just about staff happiness. Just about staff happiness. Do I need to give everybody raises or do I simply allow the inter-year period to do its work? That's the question. That's the question. It's actually quite surprising how low staff happiness is. Like who, who's unhappy and why? These guys are kind of miserable. Why are you so unhappy? Not getting paid enough. Well, especially with the training and, and, and then not getting paid enough on top of that, right? Prestige of those rooms aren't that great either. Um, like overall staff happiness seems to be okay. It's just, yeah, it's middling, I guess. A lot of teachers not having the best of times. This guy's not really pleased at all. What's wrong with you, buddy? Tired, exhausted even. That's the thing. That's why I feel like the inter-year period might just do the trick for us. Might just do the trick for us. The training has been completed. Let's go ahead and get you training, buddy. In what? Comic timing. Let's go. The funny campus. Everyone's a comedian here. Pick you up. Drop you off. Let's go. Get to work. There we go. Well, I got so many more days left this academic year to get trainings done. I think we'll be in a better position, though. I think so. The one last thing we need. Students are doing all right. See some relationships budding. Average academic results are 85%. That's not bad. Average student happiness is 70% without us making any like hubbub, no huge like events or anything wild like that. So that's been pretty good, I would say. Good grades across the board as well. Very pleased with the, uh, with the, with the grades I'm seeing constantly. A's, A pluses, like this is good stuff. This campus has really turned around, like really turned around. I'm very pleased. I am very pleased. Uh, buddy over here wants training. Why don't we go ahead and queue him up for it? Hasn't he already been trained a few times? He's been trained once before. Sure, let's train you still. Uh, maintenance. 
Pokemons. Sure, why not? Go with that. And hopefully as soon as we're done here, Buddy will make his way over. Pick you up. Drop you off. Cool. Challenge completed is just the uh, train three staff members. Oh, he's, he, he wants to work. I mean, I, I admire the, uh, the work ethic. But I need your training. There we go. Let's go. Let's go. Get to it. Hopefully staff then afterwards, in between years, when they'll be able to take their breaks, they'll, uh, they'll feel a lot better. Hopefully. <laughs> you know what I could have done is up over here, I could have put a washroom instead. Because uh, we don't have really a staff dedicated washroom, and, and anytime the staff need to use a washroom, they gotta go all the way over here, where there's really only two, um, uh, two toilets, which is not enough. Not enough, so maybe I, I need to replace this with a toilet. We'll see. We'll see how uh, how things go between academic years. Staff happiness is now dropping down to 58%. That's not ideal. In a worst case scenario, if when the year ends, we don't see those numbers go up, we'll give everybody raises. Again, like I said, we can afford to give people raises. Look at that. We'll be fine. <laughs> we'll be fine. Maintenance one complete. Excellent. Buddy, do you want training? You need training. Go ahead and send you in for aerodynamics. Let's go. I'll head over right away, I think. Almost. Come on. I don't really want you doing maintenance, but... Fair enough. Come on, dive in there. No, 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 come on. Come on, I've queued you up for training. Aerodynamics, let's go. We don't have enough time. Pointless now. We'll get like halfway there and then uh, let's stop. 61% at the end of the academic year, give or take, a couple days. Come on. Don't let me have to give you raises. Well, that would be a clever move. It would be a very clever move. It's gonna have to be raises, I think. We'll give it some time in summer break and then we'll see. I'm actually surprised at how long uh, this has taken. Quite surprised at how long this has taken. Let's go ahead and take a look at our uh, academic uh, results, the, uh, the, the awards. I don't know how many we've won this year. Pass rate of 100% still. Average results are still pretty good. Got ourselves the Queen of Clubs. We've got ourselves Rising Staff. Excellent. Lots of training this year. Teacher of the Year as well. Good stuff. And Campus of the Year. All right. Good stuff. No academic excellence, unfortunately. But overall, we actually did quite well, uh, quite well this year. Got the Student Choice Award as well. Nice. You know what? Pretty pleased, all things considered. Pretty pleased. Got some more uh, kudosh from completing our kudosh career goal as well, which is nice. But yes, let's see now if we can't get this up to 65%. Staff happiness, how are we looking? I think a lot of staff will be uh, will still be helping students, right? Maintain their uh, their needs. Go on a break. You as well. Go on a break. This guy's done. Go on a break. These guys take some breaks. Let them enjoy their uh, their lives a bit as well. Summer breaks. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, people are coming through. How are you feeling? Slowly, there we go, regaining some energy. Mood's going up. Alright, alright. I mean, it's a very good staff room, in fact. Okay, okay, 61%. Probably we can go higher than that, even. You on a break? You should... Oops, that's not what I meant. I meant go on a break. Enjoy yourself. You as well. Removing invaders. Ugh. Wish it wasn't, we weren't so preoccupied with this. <laughs> go on a break. Why looking for work? It's the end of the year. Enjoy yourself. You as well. Free time? Yeah, go on a break. You look like you're working. No, you're having a drink. Okay, good, good, good. Good, excellent. And then it said littering. <laughs> you're you're the one who's gonna have to clean it up if you actually litter. Come on. Munchers have been taken care of, or life munchers, I should say. Good stuff. Good stuff. I will pick you up and drop you off. No, he's using the washroom. That's fine. Whatever sort of break you want. How are we looking? Sixty-two percent. I guess the other option is to fire staff, right? That's the other way to, to make the averages higher, just fire unhappy staff. It's like, hey, you've been really bringing our numbers down, so uh, I'm going to fire you. You can go on a break as well. I'm not the happiest camper here. 
on a break. Staff grabbing a bite, I guess. Kinda hungry. Go for it. Chow down. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff. Right, so they, 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 they do take care of their needs at a decent enough pace. Just gotta keep an eye on these guys, right? Who like, keep working on pastoral care and stuff like that and they don't actually take breaks of their own. Despite clearly desperately needing them. Take a break. Take a break. I think it's gonna have to be your races. I think that's just the only uh, way to go about it right now. 63%? Almost there. I'm like, I'm challenging myself. It's like a personal challenge to see if we can't get it to 65 without giving those raises, but I think it will have to be. Keep going, come on. Who else? Is there like anyone who's a bit more on the yellow side of happiness? Who's not already on a break? Got all these guys covered. Yeah, maybe this guy over here. Use a break. Sure, let's go for it. Come on now, come on now. 63%, we're so close. We're so close. Come on, the other way. Don't go down, go up. I think it's gonna be raises. All right, fine. I'm gonna give it like another like 30 seconds to a minute maybe. And uh, and if that doesn't fly, then we'll uh, we'll go ahead and, and look at some, uh, some raises. Because I can only wait so long staring at a number. <laughs> 63. Come on, baby. I believe in you. I believe in you. Go up. I'm actually surprised at uh, how difficult it is to maintain staff happiness. Thought we were doing pretty good, you know? Thought we were doing pretty good. But I guess if every time they use the washroom, their happiness goes down, it's like there's not much I could do about that. Yeah, it might have to be raises. All right. Okay, fine. Have it your way. I mean, the other option, of course, is to uh, really crank that... Um, the, the tipping point of when they go to take a break. But let's go ahead and, and, and do some raises. Campus overview, let's go ahead and help who out first. Janitors? Sure. So how do I... Oh, is this not gonna go up until like next year? I'm not sure exactly how to approach it. So satisfy all salary requests. So if I do that, what does that do? Nothing. I just give everybody a 1% staff increase, uh, salary increase. What does that do? Put that a few times there. Did that eat into our... Oh, there you go. <laughs> Money makes the world go round, doesn't it? Money makes the world go round. All right, fair enough, fair enough. Maybe it would have been fine without having done that, but I think it would have just taken us a little bit longer, and uh, time is of the essence. Uh, Spiff and more, don't fool yourself. This does not represent your crowning achievement or good winning out over evil. No, you've achieved an academic standard, and we're simply recognizing it with this brochure. Get over yourself, honestly. Jeez. I feel like they've been getting harsher and harsher as we get further and further along. Like, come on. We we rescued this school. We rescued this school. We got ourselves the Spiff and Moore statue as well, uh, which is all well and good. But you know what? With that all done, I think we can go ahead and leave Spiff and Moore once and for all and prepare ourselves um, for uh, for Fluffborough. That was a that was a challenging map. It, well, it started off very challenging. And then uh, closer to the end, it became a bit more like meticulous, I would say. But we managed to get there. We managed to get there well enough. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at Fluffborough over here. We'll be teaching. Oh, actually, we don't know what we'll be teaching yet. Don't, doesn't it normally say what we'll be teaching? And then there are two more campuses that will be unlocked after we complete Fluffborough. I don't know if they'll unlock at the same time or not, but there are a few more uh, course types to discover. And there's still a few more mechanics, actually, to be introduced as well, which is... Uh, Kind of interesting because we finished what two four five campuses so you'd expect them all to have been introduced already but nope uh, either way it'll be interesting because fluffborough you start with quarter of a million so no loan to kick things off with but i'm sure at this stage in the game there's going to be a twist right because in the order of uh, of approach fluffborough comes after spiffinmore so one would assume fluffborough is the tougher of the two campuses and i'm curious exactly how that ends up uh, playing out folks i hope you enjoyed this session if you did you know what to do let me know by leaving a like and a comment down below. As always, it makes a very big difference. And just letting me know what people are enjoying on the channel, what I should do more or less of, how I should go about doing it. I'm sure you'll, you're, you're all familiar with the drill by now. But as always, as well, of course, a 
massive thanks goes out to all of the channel members and patrons who've been supporting the channel on a monthly basis. Y'all keep us alive and running smoothly. And of course, a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time. Cheers.